All right. Well, um, I've got a hen that's broody. She's been broody almost all summer. Poor thing. So uh, I'm gonna. I'm not really looking to have any more chickens, but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and move her into what we call the feed shed, which is also kind of got a built-in brooder <clears throat> where we can either put store-bought chicks and use it as a brooder or we can put hens in there and let them set and uh, you know hatch our own chicks. So um, <clears throat> I'll show you a little video of that. We, I'm gonna grab her and she's a pretty small hen, but uh, I think she can, I'm gonna move 10 eggs in, with, in there with her and um, see if she'll set on them. So you're supposed to do this after dark but I've been outside working and it's hot and it's getting later and I'm hungry. And so I'm just gonna do it now. It's not long before dark. I'm just gonna do it now and we'll see what happens. All right, so what I got here is a, it's actually a kitty litter box. And I just put some shavings in it. There she is. These are all eggs that were laid today. I'm sorry if you can't see this very well. I've got a chest mount thing on and I'm not very good with it. Slide this thing back in there. It's already kind of dark in here, so that might help. But I've got water and a feeder set up. We'll come back in a minute. See if she's setting on them. So this is the feed shed. And this was like a better built building. And this was a workbench here, this part originally. And um, I built in kind of a permanent brooder to it. And then when we're not using it for brooding birds, I, I use it for storage and stuff. So um, works really, really well. Um, I put down a rubber mat so it doesn't rot out the... Um, wood and you can open the doors sweep everything out into a trash can bring it to the compost pile just works perfect i can see her trying to move her eggs a little bit <clears throat> she'll position them where she wants them let me open this back up Yeah, she's a little unsure, but we'll come back in a minute. 